Bobo. Yeah. And publicly, well, yeah. <laughs> there's there's more that we can say. And so, of Nissan, course, there's many Mitsubishi, things going on. Mercedes Benz. That's right. Yeah. So, you know, well, oh, really? we already have it. Yeah. Mercedes, we announced that we're providing the engine for the next generation A class. So, so I mean, we've been talking here about price, but I mean, it seems to me that you guys are, are developing some clever technology that others aren't. So, I see you guys came out with the Horse C15. Yeah. And um, you, you, you package it and it's described as the dimensions of a large briefcase. That's right. So, I mean, <laughs> tell us about what this thing does. Yeah. So that's, uh, so we have a, a few different areas of focus, right? And one of them is um, ex extended range EVs. So that's all about making these systems as compact as possible. And of course, maximizing the efficiency for that specific operating uh, range, mm -hmm. you know, to just charge the battery, right? It runs at like a pretty steady state speed too. That's right. right. Yeah. I mean, everything else about the way the vehicle moves is all electronically controlled. Right. And so you can imagine like the use case behind that is a lot of companies have made these BEV platforms, you know, and they have frunks mm -hmm. and they have small front ends, you know, and have kind of optimized space around this electric uh, platform. So now that the consumer is saying, wait a second, I'm not ready to make the big jump. And there's a, you know, an obvious pushback to hybrids. There just isn't the space to put an engine, you know, one of their traditional engines into that. Um, so they have a choice to make. They're either going to scrap this platform, which has the newest connectivity, infotainment features, mm. ADAS features, all the latest and greatest tech, um, and still sell the legacy platform in parallel, like we've seen happen recently, or they have to figure out a way to get an engine that does fit. You know, and that's what we, we can bring. We can bring something that can fit into a creative space, yeah? So maybe it's not in the front. You know, maybe it's behind the wheels in the back, you know? Uh, because of the compactness of the solutions that we're bringing, it opens up options to fit into BEV platforms.